<laughs> See, she's mean. Ooh, Absolutely mean. Happened. <laughs> but you did. Hi. Hi. Morning. I've been it, up here a while. I know. What have you been doing? I took a shower. I folded laundry. Did made you made the bed. Did you poop for a long time? <laughs> no. Are you are you down? I am down. How much? I think point eight. Yay, casino. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, mm -hmm. we need to hurry up and film because today's gift exchange. It is? Yes. I don't think it should be. <laughs> but I want presents. <laughs> you can't have. You can't have. So you're right in my face. All right. Well, go ahead. I got laundry folded. You have laundry to put away. No, it has laundry to put away. Yay. What are we gonna do after the gift exchange and after we film? We can't gift exchange. Nothing? No, because you have one gift. And I want it. <laughs> All right. So. Is that my snack? That is. Hmm. All right, we gotta go film the way in so we can get it up. Yep. Hey, and we got meat on the smoker. Yay. All right, if we go into our closet, as you can see right here, this right here, this one side is mine and the stuff up top. Now the stuff down below, that's all Emily, except for the suitcase, which has some old work clothes of mine that probably don't fit. But all of this over here, everything from there over and all the shoes, my God, the shoes, that's all Emily and everything on the top, that's her too. But I want to show you something funny. wearing a Christmas sweater. <laughs> Had it for years. It never fit me. Now it's actually a little big, but yeah, there's that. All right, we got to go down and do weigh in. The bacon's ready. I know you want bacon, but I want waffles. Well, I can so. have bacon and waffles. Oh, it's going to steam my glasses. Really? Oh. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. We need to save this bacon grease. Bacon. Yep, and we're, like I said, we're getting low on bacon grease, so we need to, we need to save it. The grease? Yes. Need to. I can't believe you dropped the mitt in the oven. I did. All right, now I have to upload the video from today. What are you doing? Making waffles. I seen you just move the trash can. I did. Do you not want people to know that we have trash? <laughs> no, I threw away the packet. I'm making the keto chow maple waffle. Okay. Flavored waffles. So someone told me that if you use a half a cup of heavy cream, a half a teaspoon of baking powder, two tablespoons melted butter, one large egg, and then your keto chow flavor yeah. that you want, that they make really good waffles. Now it says it makes five mini waffles, but I'm doing one big waffle. I'm hoping it'll make two big waffles. <laughs> well, yeah, because I need a waffle. Yeah. So it is ready and there's something right here. What is that? I don't know. I think it's from the last time we had waffles. 
Did you not clean it? No. So this is a really thick consistency. That looks like fudge. It looks like cookie dough, doesn't it? So we're right. giving it a try. I don't like the looks of that. We're gonna try it out. It smells really good. What kind is it? Maple waffle keto chai. Why is it so thick? It supposedly, that's how it's supposed to be. We're gonna have a waffle cookie. Yep. So, we'll see how it turned out. All right. I was never one for pancakes, but I always loved waffles. Yeah. So, I like both. So waffles are where it's at. Hopefully this turns out. Hopefully. Can you smell it? Yes, I smell it and it's coming out of the thing. And if you'd have made it in the mini, yeah. we'd have breadsticks. <laughs> I want a big waffle. So I'm hoping it turns out. It needs to turn green and say it's ready. It takes a little while. Yeah, it's a bigger waffle. Duh. It turned green, it's ready to go. All right, let's see it. All right. It didn't sound ready to go. Uh oh. Ooh, look at that. It smells so good. Ow. <laughs> Let me do it. Ow. What <laughs> a fart. There we have it. Can you try it? I want to start the other one so it's ready. All right. This is a really thick batter. So this time, since it's spread out really good, I'm just going to put it in the middle. See how it turns out if you just put it in the middle. Yep. Flip it in. And flip it. Okay. You want to try it? Yes. So I like butter on mine. So I need butter. You know, I didn't think it was going to turn out. But I feel like there's a but. There. It's really good. It smells really good. So. That is really good. So how did you make it again? Recap. Four ounces heavy cream. Mm -hmm. Two tablespoons melted butter. Mm -hmm. One large egg. Uh -huh. A half a teaspoon of baking powder. Uh -huh. And then whatever flavor keto shell you want. Mix it and it looks like cookie dough. It's really thick. So easy enough. That's really good. Very good. Mm -hmm. You know what? what? I don't think you would know that it wasn't a real waffle. No. I don't think you'd know that it was a low carb keto chow waffle. No. Definitely would not. All right, I'm turning this off so I can eat the rest of that. <laughs> what? So I feel really full really fast. Do you think it could be the five pieces of bacon? No. Couldn't, couldn't possibly be the bacon. Never blame the bacon, ever. Mm. I never eat this early. You were hungry because we went to bed kind of early and we ate early yesterday. I just realized it's only 1030. <laughs> All right, so we got this, we got this syrup here. It's just Maple Grove Farm sugar free and there's three carbs. There's three carbs in it, but two of it's sugar alcohol. So it is what it is. Yeah. But it doesn't even really need it, though. It was really good on the waffle. 
It doesn't, is it really good on it? Yeah. Oh, you didn't even have it? It's, I mean, it's maple flavored waffles, so. <laughs> but. It doesn't even need it though. No, it don't need it, but it was good. Yep. All right, we have a turkey on the smoker and the ribs have been on now for three hours and we are going to wrap them in foil and put them back on. Yeah. The turkey temperature right now is 139 in the breast, 145 in the leg. The breast will always take longer. Once it hits 165, it'll be done. All right. Thing one. Yay. All right, the ribs will stay on for two more hours. They've been on for three. They'll be on for two in the foil, and then we will take the foil off of them, baste them with some sugar-free barbecue sauce, and they'll remain there for another hour. So, six hours total. Hi, Noah. Look, I have ribs. I have ribs. And there's Emily. And I don't really like her today. I could say the same about you. Me and Emily have just not been getting along today for some reason. Because everything is my fault. Anyway, just pulled ribs off the smoker. Look how beautiful they are. I almost forgot to film. The bone just falls right out. They're tender. They did take a lot longer than I wanted them to though. I think that's why everybody's angry today because we're hungry. You wanna try them? Yeah. Go ahead. I don't know what to get. Yeah, grab them. All of them? Sure, get your plate. It's hot. Ooh. <laughs> See how the bone just fell out? Yeah. Now take a bite. Hot. How is it? It's good. Ooh. Real good? Mm -hmm. For real, what do you think? Mm. You like that seasoning? Mmm. Sorry. I, I used the Weber Cowboy seasoning because we had it. And I didn't know what to do with it, so I figured, well, ribs can be cowboy. You know I love the cowboy ribs? They're good. They're hot. And then we're using Sweet Baby Ray's sugar-free. Yep. Hickory. So, normally the ribs I cooked the ribs at 250 and normally we'd cook them for three hours uncovered, two hours wrapped, and then one hour with sauce. We did that and they had to go like an extra hour because they just wasn't to uh, the, the bone wasn't separating from the meat yet. So anyway, my turn to eat. Here I am. This has been the most boring vlog ever. All right, so here's the deal. We, I got up early this morning and Emily had a turkey mm -hmm. that to smoke today. Yeah. So I put the turkey on and then we put ribs on also with the turkey. The turkey for some reason was done a couple hours before the ribs. 
and it was unlike the turkey that we had on Thanksgiving because the skin was so hard. Mm -hmm. It wasn't even rubber, it was almost plastic. But the turkey that was inside of the skin was very, very juicy and good. Yeah. So that was kind of a bummer. So it was like, okay, well, what about, you know, maybe the ribs would be better. The ribs took so much longer than normal, even though we did everything like we have in the past. I don't know why. Maybe it's because it's colder outside. That could definitely have something to do with the cook time, right? Colder out? Yeah. We also used a different kind of pellet. But we've used them pellets before on the ribs and them pellets were fine. So my problem still lies with the fact that last week I was sick. My taste has been messed up and I'm hungry, but nothing is good. The waffles were good. Emily did make keto chow waffles and that was really good. So. I'm just going to have to eat sweets. <laughs> I'm going to have to have treats because either I'm not hungry enough for meat or my taste is messed up. Either way. Even with your taste, if it's still off, you're, you're really not a fan of turkey anyway. And yeah, and you're really not a huge fan of ribs anyway. Definitely not a huge fan of ribs or turkey. So I think you just want your ground beef. That doesn't even sound good to me. What about Chalk Zero Reese Cups? Them sound really wonderful. <laughs> or peanut butter cups. Chalk Zero sounds really good. <laughs> so anyway, what I'm trying to say is Today's the worst vlog ever, and we're sorry. This, this smoker has ruined our day because we've been handcuffed to this thing yeah. while these ribs cooked for eight hours, and they shouldn't have had to have taken that long. And normally they only take six, yeah. like six, six and a half to be fall off the bone like we like them. This time it was eight hours, and they were still fall off the bone, but I think the quality of the ribs themselves, they were very, very fatty. I don't know. We've had better. We've definitely had better. This, the smoker has ruined today. <sighs> Today's because, just been kind of a disappointment. Because we couldn't do anything. And then Emily's been mean to me. No. Em em Emily's not mean. Okay, there, there was this- She's been a grumpy butt. There was this one time where she was making keto chow pudding. <laughs> and I didn't put it in because I'm being nice. Oh, is that yeah. what we're calling it? Yeah. So every time she was she was waiting on me, but I had pictures, I had videos on my phone that was uploading, so I couldn't get up immediately and go film. So I went in there, and then she was going to start. And I said, but let's hurry up and not make this take so long. And every time she started, I was like... Cutting I, me off. Yeah, I, I'd cut her off, and I was saying, make sure this doesn't take too long. Hurry up, just get started. Well, she eventually got mad... I got fed up. She got mad, wouldn't talk to me. <laughs> so, yeah, there's that. So anyway, she's been mean. <laughs> we are just now getting ready to, I'm getting ready to put on shoes. Even though I've been dressed all morning, waiting on Emmy. Right? <laughs> I have shoes on, I'm just cold. And me and Noah sat in here and I guess I kind of watched it. I didn't really watch it with him, but he wanted to watch Predator. It was a Predator that I've never seen before. Yeah. It must have been a new one. It, it was. It had a guy, from, Dog bark. a guy from This Is Us is on, was on there, and it had to have been newer. So, yeah. Anyway, we're just now getting ready to go out and leave the house. And we have no clue we have, what we're doing. We have no clue. I feel like we've already shopped at every store or option that we have. We have. And everything like I already know what everybody has, but I still have gifts to buy. Everything that we that like jumps out and says this is for them, we've already gotten that. So now we're just looking for something that just jumps out and says, hey, this is for them. 
Yeah, I'm just tired of looking. Unfortunately, it's like every store, it seems like, has the exact same daggone thing. Yeah. Unfortunately. And clothes just ain't fun. They are for me. That's what I want for Christmas. Well, you I need clothes. You'll get none. And like it. So you didn't get me clothes? I did not get her clothes. I honestly did not get her clothes. Did you get me a purse? And I am sorry. I did not get you that. Shoes? No. Train. <laughs> Here comes a train. Did you give me sheets? I don't know if she caught me. You've been known to buy sheets. I bought her good sheets one time on Valentine's Day. Yeah. And she didn't like it. No. They were the good hotel sheets that at the time they were like 60 bucks and that was like 10 years ago. And that seemed like a lot of money back then for sheets that she underappreciated. For Valentine's Day. It's the gift that keeps on giving. You can hear Derek giggling in the other room. He's not, he's not the only one who would laugh over that. That was the worst. And I think he learned his lesson that year. Oh, no. <laughs> I never learned my lesson. <laughs> all right, we're going to go somewhere. I don't know where. We need bacon. That's about all I know. Oh, yeah. I made bacon today. And even it wasn't good. Someone overcooked it. It's like I put it in the oven. I checked it. This is what happened. <laughs> I put it in the oven. And then I came back and checked it right before we filmed our just our weigh-in results, which mm -hmm. was like nine minutes. Mm -hmm. Nine minutes later, the bacon has a brownish, a dark tint to it. It's crunchy, and it's just not good today. Hmm. So what you're saying is you put bacon in the oven and then walked away and started doing something else? I really didn't even walk away. I just turned around the other side so we could film. I never even left. Hmm. She, then hmm. she opened the door and it was smoking. Sounds familiar. I know. <laughs> I feel like I've read this book. All right. We'll see whatever we do. Here we are. Here we are. Hi. All right, so we went out to the outlet mall. Yeah. And probably spent more money than we should have. Yeah. But at least we did get out. And I think just here at the outlet mall, I did like 7,000 steps. No. I did 9,000. I walked like three miles here at the outlet mall. I got new shoes. And of course, Noah, yeah. Even though it's right before Christmas, Noah has to get new shoes. <laughs> has to. He had to. He just wasn't going to let it stop. Yeah, he wasn't shut up. So he got new vans. <laughs> and... I guess we're going to go home and make some burger patties and stuff for lunches. Yeah. We need to. Some keto chows and burger patties. <laughs> yes. Which means we have to stop at the grocery store to get heavy cream. Oh, yeah. And I need mozzarella for my meatballs I want to make. Are you making the meatballs tonight? Probably. So there's that. Yeah. I know we're boring. Yeah, but not, it's not. right before Christmas. We're trying to get shopping done. So, yeah. Anyway, that's that. <laughs> See, she's mean. What Absolutely you, mean. What just happened? <laughs> What'd you do? This is the best, hottest cheese ever. But I can't have cheese for the rest of the month. What are you getting? I'm getting roast beef. Why? And ham. How it's much is it? Five ninety nine. Buy one, get one free. Or half off. Oh, that's a good deal. Yeah. So they only have one thing of roast beef in the big pack. Ready? Okay. How are you? Hey, Laura, Laura, so we got heavy whipping cream. It's not a good deal, but it's a better deal than going somewhere else. Hmm. Emily got Parmesan because I don't know why. Maples. 
Meatballs, yes. Yeah, I want meatballs. She wanted some of the... She actually got the two good yogurt, but there's four here. The uh, Meyer lemon, what does that mean? That's what flavor it is. <laughs> Three carbs in a thing, yeah. And then they had Oscar Meyer bacon. It was buy one, get one, so it was eight thirty nine for one. So it was like four nineteen a pound. So we got four of them. Because we we're out of bacon. Yeah, we should have got 20. And then, as you can see, her buy one, get one. Half I off. switched it out. I got two roast beef. Okay. So that's that. Now we're going home because I'm ready to sit on the couch. Hmm. Memory of recording. Yeah. Little cart. That's all we need. Right? Right. Little, Little cart. cart. All right. So it is Tuesday, and we failed to do an outro to our vlog. On Saturday. So we're going to do that now. Yeah, we're doing that now. So we had... It was a boring day. Yeah. We had bad food from the smoker. Actually, it wasn't bad food. My taste is screwed up. It's just jacked. It wasn't like, oh my gosh. The ribs were, were all right, but I think the cut... Nothing amazing. I think they were cooked right, but the ribs, I think they were like extra fatty. There was something not right with them. Derek and Noah seemed to love them. Turkey was, I think maybe it, it had been too soon to Thanksgiving to actually enjoy turkey again. Yeah, although, but it was on sale. Although I have snacked on some turkey today. Yeah, and Noah loves to snack on turkey. And you're pushing me away. I'm sorry. No. Well, we really do get along. Well, sometimes. <laughs> so, except when she hit me in the car. And that's, I forgive her. <sighs> I forgive her, but I was poking... It the, sounded way harder than what it was. I was poking the bear. He was. <laughs> and I knew that was going to happen. That's why I started filming as I started to mess with Because he knows it. how to get under my skin. Because I knew how to get hit, and I wanted it on camera. And what was That's funny so is... That's so awful. So she was doing DDPY earlier, and I kept trying to get her to go up into a bridge, because she was doing a modified. Yeah. And if she did, I was actually filming that. I was going to kick her hand out from under her. <laughs> that way she fell. <laughs> but See? she didn't go back up. Well, anyway, that is our Saturday vlog. It's not very exciting, but some days we do more than other times, and sometimes we yeah, just... Yeah, it's Christmas season, and we've been shopping, it seems like, every weekend, plus a couple days during the week, and it's just kind of what it looks like for us, eating the way that we do, how sometimes we have to sit at home and wait for the meat to be done. We did have amazing waffles, though. Them waffles were great. And you know what? You don't have to have the maple waffle to make waffles. You can make make you can make you can waffles. make whatever flavor you like. You can make waffles out of vanilla. Yeah, and there's many many different ways of making it. So if you have a certain way that you like to make your keto chow waffles or just keto waffles, let us know because I want to know. I like to use the recipe for the banana waffles with the peanut butter drizzle. Yeah, that but is every the time I've made waffles, I like to make. I've used a different recipe every time. And they all turn out good. Yeah. There's like more than, there's a lot of different ways to skin a cat. So tell me your favorite way to make waffles. But if you're going to skin the cat, make sure you don't waste the meat. All right. You got Share us your waffle recipes. Have a great yeah. night. And this is Wednesday. So we'll see you Friday night live. Yeah.